So as most of you guys know, a few weeks ago, the Packers were in the running for Odell Beckham Jr. It was coming down reportedly to both the Packers and the Los Angeles Rams. And as you all probably already know, Odell Beckham Jr. decided to go with the Los Angeles Rams. And so, of course, um, it seemed that, you know, before Odell Beckham decided to go inside with the Los Angeles Rams, the Packers players were, you know, sort of trying to get Odell to come over here to Green Bay because I think it would have been a... I mean, at least a better situation, I think, for Odell Beckham Jr., um, especially if you look at the past few weeks after Odell has joined the team. The Rams really haven't struggled, so he's probably potentially rethinking his decision a little bit. Maybe he's not, but he could potentially be. So I was going through the internet the other day, as lots of us typically do, and I came across this interesting article. I thought it was sort of funny, so I thought we'd talk about it. So it says, Devontae Adams shot down Odell Beckham jersey swap after Packers snub. So as you can read right here, it says Packers receiver Devonta Adams wasn't exactly thrilled about the idea of doing a jersey swap with a, with pal Odell Beckham Jr. Prior to Sunday's game against the Rams in Green Bay, Adams spoke with analyst Michael Irvin about Beckham, who recently joined the Rams after being courted by the Packers during his mini free agency. Adams said Beckham inquired about the jersey swap two days before kickoff, but the Packers star shot down the idea. And then Devonta says this, I told him, go get a Cooper Cup jersey since that's obviously his guy, and that's who he wanted to be with. So, Devonta Adams, you know, a little bit jokingly, throwing some shade at Odell Beckham for not picking the Green Bay Packers, saying, why don't you go swap jerseys with Cooper Cup, you're, you know, your new best friend there, um, after deciding to join the Los Angeles Rams. And so, then apparently came out a little later that apparently later, uh, Devonta Adams basically sent his jersey to swap with Odell. So he said, that's my guy, Adams said, I love Odell. I think we would have been a great fit here but I wish nothing but the best for him. Then it says, but according to The Athletic, Adam said post-game that he sent his jersey to the Rams locker room after the Packers went after all. So I guess Devonta Adams wasn't completely serious about, you know, not actually doing a jersey swap with Odell, but he did, you know, jokingly say that. There's probably some truth in that, you know, lots of times when you, you know, throw shots at somebody, even in a joking manner, there's clearly some some truth in there. So I think Devontae would have liked if Odell Beckham Jr. would have come to the Green Bay Packers. Um, the Packers have been fine the past couple weeks, you know, when it comes to scoring points, we've been, I mean, probably the best we have been all season. I think we've averaged around somewhere around 30 points, which I saw some stat somewhere today, which is fifth best in the past two games in the NFL. So this Packers team is, you know, going to another level, I think, especially on the offensive side of the ball. So I don't think we necessarily needed Odell Beckham Jr. Personally, I thought, as you guys who have been watching the channel for the past month or so, um, I thought that Odell could have, you know, benefited this Packers team because you see a guy like that who has that talent, who, you know, plays at the caliber that he does play at adding him to a Packers roster, a Packers offense, you know, alongside Devontae Adams, I thought that would make this Packers offense that much better. But I definitely don't think we need Odell. I would have wished that he could have come here. But it seems that he picked the wrong team. A little bit unfortunate. But that is going to be all for this one. If you guys have not subscribed to the channel, feel free to subscribe to the channel. I think like 50% of people who watch the videos are subscribed. So if you haven't subscribed, you've been thinking about it, feel free to subscribe right now for Packers news, Packers content, all things Packers, multiple times every single day. So thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to drop a like on the video and I'll see you guys in the next one.